Hi guys and welcome back to another one of my videos. If you're new here, my name is Holly and thank you so so much for watching. Today I'm going to be doing a little bit of a Kmart haul. <laughs> you guys, I just can't stop, okay? I know it's a problem. I'm just, I don't want to admit to it at this point. I'm just, I'm going to keep buying, I think. But Kmart just has some good stuff at the moment. I just can't help myself. So <laughs> without further ado, let's get into it. So I guess I'll start with the thing I am most excited for. And it is this little like bunny ears. Hi guys, it's just editing me coming in to chime in on this bit um bunny ears in what universe do bunny ears look like that holly you dummy i think i meant bear ears <laughs> anyways carry on with the video type towel headband thing i've wanted one of these for a while to put on when i'm washing my face and stuff i find that all my hairs like especially all my little baby hairs get so like in the way when I'm trying to wash my face so I thought this was so cute I'm literally obsessed it says it's made for kids but I don't know I feel like I'm a child at heart so oh I just realized that probably means it's like a smaller headband size when I picked it up I was like made for kids I feel like this is made for adults but now I think I understand but good thing is I have a really tiny head and so hopefully it fits. This one, by the way, cost me $3. The next thing I got from Kmart is this head towel turban thing. I've already had one of these, but it's just lost its elastic. I've had it for like probably almost 10 years, the one I had. So I thought it was time to get a new one. And what better color than this cute pink color? This one cost me $4 and I'm really keen to try it out. I really wanted one of these because I feel like my hair is very, very weak. And I think a big reason for that is because my hair gets so knotty, like unbelievably knotty. And so if I try and brush it straight away when it's wet, it literally all just breaks. But if I don't blow dry my hair, then the back especially dries like all wavy and it's really, really weird. So basically my plan is to use this until my hair is sort of like half dry and then I'll blow dry it the rest of the way. Because the drier my hair is, the less it breaks basically that was the whole life story of my hair you're welcome another thing that i got today was actually this cardigan i'm going to be putting it in a video soon so keep your eyes peeled for that one so i won't show it to you at the moment i actually bought a couple of cardigans i got this black one as well and then i got another brown one and i got this one as well so keep your eyes peeled for a video i'm going to be trying on some kmart cardigans and stuff them and whatnot so if that's something you're interested in then subscribe because that video will be coming soon but back to the haul so this beanie is the next thing I got I'm literally so glad that I'm doing this haul because I've waited oh man <laughs> okay you guys I'm not gonna lie beanies don't suit me but they keep my head warm so you know that's the risk you pay I guess but anyways, what I was saying is that I waited until this haul to start wearing this beanie because I wanted to show you guys it was $9. So yeah, there you go. I'm very, very excited to be wearing this on my nighttime walks that I've started doing in the hopes that I get fit. The next thing I got, I'm super, super excited about this too, is a phone charger. And I just heard that sentence back and oh my God, 14 year old me would be like so disappointed that I get excited over phone chargers. But that's where we are in life now, you guys. This is the sort of stuff that excites me. So anyways, it's a two meter long phone charger. I also bought a little USB port thing too, because you know, obviously they sort of go hand in hand. And this charger costs $13 and this bit cost $8. And I know Kmart chargers can be a bit hit and miss, but I've bought a two meter long charger from Kmart before. It was about a year ago and it still works to this day. And I literally use it for the iPad, AirPods, and my phone because no one in this house has an iPhone charger besides me. So yeah, it gets used a lot and it's really lasted quite well. So 
I recommend them. You guys, I also was meant to get some games because I'm gonna be having a games night at my house soon and I just wanted to get a few more games to sort of mix it up and keep things exciting in the games sector but yeah i forgot to get them so i'm hoping that before this video goes up i'll manage to run to kmart again and grab them and i'll include those here hey you guys so i know i look kind of hectic right now <laughs> it's like 9 30 at night and i just really wanted to add this bit in because i said i would include the games that i bought so i wanted to show you um but yeah i've already showered and i'm in my pajamas and i have done my skincare routine and I did not want to be doing all that stuff again. So this is how we are looking right now. But you know what? You've got to see me looking like this so you can appreciate me when I have all that makeup on. That's how I think of it anyway. But basically the two games I got from Kmart, first of all, were Twister. This one cost me $25 and I am so excited to play this game. I haven't played Twister in years, but I think it's going to be a lot of fun. We're having a couple friends over this weekend, so we're definitely going to be playing this. And the other game I got was this game called Skipbo. This game is a lot of fun. I've played it with friends before and really, really enjoyed it. This one cost me $13 too. I actually found that Kmart had quite a good range of games, so... If you guys, if any of you are in the area of Kmart Chatswood, make sure you go have a look at what's there because there's a couple of good games there. The next two things that I got from Kmart are literally just these wooden heart boxes. They just open up like a little jewelry box or something. They remind me of something that I probably would have had when I was younger. But I bought two of these because first of all they were quite cheap. They were only $3 each. And secondly, I thought that because I work in aged care, I thought as an activity I could get people to cut out little like designs from magazines and stuff. I've done it before and it worked really well. So I got them to cut out little designs and then just glue them all over the box. And it's almost like a decoupage type thing. So yeah, that's an activity that the older people or well, some of the older people really enjoy. So I wanted to do that. And the last thing that I got from Kmart was actually an oven. So I've mentioned this a million times, but the apartment I live in doesn't have an oven or didn't have an oven. So I had to buy an electric oven. And the one I went with was one from Kmart. It's a 45 liter oven. I'll include a photo of it here. I'm not going to bring it out because it is literally massive and I would probably squash myself in the process. So far it's been really really good. We've cooked cookies and apple pies and I'm going to do some dinners in there too. It's big enough that you can fit quite a bit in there and it even comes with like a rotisserie thing so you can literally just put that in the middle of the oven and cook your chicken in there. I probably wouldn't because I'm vegetarian but you know it's an option there if you want to do that. But yeah, I really recommend that oven. It's been really, really good so far. And they have warranty on them too. But you guys, that brings me to the end of this video. I really hope you enjoyed this one. Please, please give this video a like and subscribe if you want to see more of my videos. I would really, really appreciate it. And hopefully I will see you in my next video. Bye, you guys. Bye. Mwah.